He's a confessed child molester who cut off his tether and then took off. And tonight, U.S. Marshals need your help finding Michael Flaker, a sexual predator who easily blends in with other retirees. And Marie Laflame joins us now with the hunt for Detroit's most wanted. The U.S. Marshals are putting out a call for your help. They say 73-year-old Michael Flaker easily blends in with other retirees. Only he's a confessed child molester who cut his tether and took off. A 73-year-old man wanted for criminal sexual conduct, eight counts. This investigation spans out of multiple uh, states. Uh, he's charged here out of Michigan, Macomb County. There are horrific charges with disturbing details that Michael Flaker stood before a judge and confessed to. This guy is a complete sexual predator. He's done it before to multiple kids. Um, we believe that this investigation in other state is not over with. Police say he preys on children gaining access, then violating their trust. The victim in this case is so uh, distraught, um, so hurt by this. I mean, you, you're reading over the text messages that go back and forth. You know, you can't explain this. Deputy U.S. Marshal Aaron Garcia says the text messages between Flaker and his victim shows an admittance of guilt and the extreme lifelong pain his actions have caused. The victims in these text messages are, are obviously concerned. Um, they're asking him, why me? And I'm concerned you know, for other people. After pleading guilty to the sex crimes, Flaker was put on a tether until sentencing. But on January 24th, police say they got an alert his tether had been cut. And this is where they say they found it in the area of 22 Mile Road in Central Park in Shelby Township. At this point, he's out there. He's on the run. He knows he pled guilty. He knows what he did wrong. Michael Flaker is six feet tall, 240 pounds, and police believe he has the support and the means to stay in hiding. He has money. He's had jobs. His whole, he's educated. Uh, he has careers. He has retirement. We believe he is getting help from family that don't want to cooperate or come forward. Police say he has connections to northern Michigan, Illinois, and Florida. Priority number one for the U.S. Marshals. And this week, Deputy Garcia says... It's personal in the law enforcement community. We're fathers. I'm a father. We got children and we take these cases seriously and we would do whatever we need to do to locate this guy, find him, arrest him to make sure that no other children are in harm at this guy's hands. Now, as always, there is a cash reward for any information leading to the arrest of Michael Flaker or any of Detroit's most wanted. You can call the U.S. Marshals anytime at 313-234-5656. I'm Anne-Marie LaFlame, 7 Action News.